Hey guys, and welcome to the first hour of Civilization 4 Beyond the Sword, the 4X hex strategy game um, by Sid Mier, 2K Studios, Firaxis, all of them. So, honestly, I have no idea how to play the game very well. In the distant future, humanity commands nature, shifting from the, shifting from the clay into its sculpture. Okay, so that's a very combat oriented. Let's just hit play now. Let's go for a single continent game because water travel is annoying. Low sea, random climate, and let's go for a standard. I don't know. Um, I'm going to, let's see here. Philosophical, charismatic. Um, something, something, rise, son of Rome. Viking! No. It's Catherine, Peter. You can be Joseph Stalin. That's... But you can be Stalin, but you can't be Hitler. That makes no sense. They're both the equally terrible. Mysticism and hunting. I think I'll go for the Incan Empire. Uh... Sun rises on the year 4000 BC. Since time immemorial, the Incan people have lived a nomadic life. After years of wandering, they are ready to settle down and found your first city. Your people have vested absolute power in you, trusting that you can build a civilization to stand the test of time. Alright, I start with my damaging guys. But I want to go to my settlers. Want them to move up here. I've played a little bit of Civ um, Revolution. I want you to build your city. No. You build your city and you go to the capital of the city. Okay, you can go up here. Let's start with that. Um, let's see here. Stonehenge gives me a free monument for each city. It takes 30 turns for me. Gives me 8 culture and a great profit. Uh Yeah, let's go with Stonehenge. Meanwhile, you scouts start exploring. And let's see my science. I want to start with hunting. You guys want, I want you to go up here. <sighs> see, I have. Let's see. Next, it, um, fishing, I want to make the most out of every tile I have. Oh. 
found the Ottomans. If I were smart, I would probably just declare war and take them out immediately, but I don't have any real damaging units anyway. Um... Yeah. You guys need to go up there. Oh, hey, my town is... My city is bigger. Oh, man, I have more culture. Oh, that... I figured that would just give them... Give me the bonus from the... Village. Give a man a fish, and you feed him for a day. Teach a man to fish. Somehow I get the feeling that that's just been a proverb for even longer than that guy. has been around... Was around, so... Archery will be important. Someone found founded Buddhism. Oh, I got a worker. Yes! I can improve my main city now. You guys go here. Oh, I have a settler? Oh, from this village. Hmm. First off, I need to get my settlers out of there. Because there's a lion over there. Oh boy, I found Egypt. Most importantly, I have archery. Woohoo. Mining will be good. You guys build your city there. I think that... A monument will be useful. Um, they want to join the Ottomans? What? No! You guys are mine. I brought you into this world. Hey, my scout found another village. Alright, workers, I want you to... Just build improvements wherever you see fit. Looks like they're building a road. Meh. Oh jeez. Please no. Yes! Oh no. You're dead. He is so dead. Really? Dang! The man who moves a mountain begins by carrying away small stones. Animal husbandry allows workers to build pasture. Um, I gained gold. Yes. I need you to fortify until healed. I am impressed that a scout beat anything really. And you get... Given you're an explorer, you're gonna be in this terrain often. Gandhi just discovered Hinduism, I guess. Oh, I found... China. <sighs> Do you have anything? Oh. I guess I'd have to do this up here. Financial advisor. Um.
I don't want to... Much more important than gold is my research. I don't know why I'm having my combat unit run around like this. Oh, it's Boudicca. Blessed shall be the fruit of thy cattle, the increase of thy kind, and the flocks of thy sheep. Let's see, I can find horses now. Um, I can build a cottage. I can make a terrace. I can get metal casting. Bronze working looks more useful overall, but I think I'll go with masonry. I want to be able to upgrade my cities more and more. Stonehenge. All right. Um, yeah, I'll definitely need some barracks there. Over here, uh, make another worker. Or a worker. I don't know if they already had one. It is from their foes, not their friends, that cities learn the lesson of building high walls. I can build a quarry. Uh, let's learn how to make pottery. I have no idea what the perfect path is for technologies or anything. Why aren't I finding any barbarians to fight? Hath not the potter power over the clay to make one vessel unto honor and another unto dishonor? Hmm. I'm guessing that the bonus of this over a granary is the two culture. make polytheism. Oh, I'm losing gold per turn. Hang on. Um, guess I need to get rid of some of my research. What are you? You work on building a road. Bloods have washed out some of the routes near the Ottoman city of Istanbul. Was it once Constantinople? I can g build the Great Wall in 11 turns. Barbarians cannot enter that area. The owner receives even more great general points. That is good. Yay. Faster growth is good. Build that mine. That is Ramsey Ramesses. Ramesses? Yeah. yeah, after the Great Wall I'll build an archer here. Finally. Haha. <laughs> 
not at all similar are the race of the immortal gods and the race of men who walk upon the earth. Hmm. Discover priesthood. I got the worker here. Um, I'll make this guy with combat one. This worker. Just build improvements. Oh boy. Alright, you get a perk. Combat 2. Um. Let's give you Raider, because that's what you're most likely to be doing. Um. You go here. And then next turn you'll build a cottage. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. I guess. I'm exploring this half of the world with this unit, but I want to have direct control. What can I say? I'm a controlling crazy warmonger. That's not a good thing. Boudicca adopts slavery. That's terrible. But I get the Great Wall, which is not terrible. Although, historically, it doesn't make sense because I don't have the Mongols knocking at my door, but... Hey, it's whatever. And I did it without slave labor. Eat it, Boudicca. It is entirely seemly. Ha-ha. man killed in battle. Lie mangled by the bronze no. spear. In his death, all things appear fair. Let's get writing, that's really important. <laughs> I don't even know what I should consider. my freaking civilization at this point. <laughs> because I have Stonehenge, I'm gonna have the Oracle, I have the Great Wall. <laughs> oh, where's my worker? Um, worker, peasant, but why are you out there? Uh, oh, actually, yeah, that makes sense. I want that road. All right, I have another one of these guys. Let's build some barracks. Meanwhile, you guys start heading this way. Can't let In Istanbul have everything to the east. I'm pretty sure geographically none of this actually makes sense. Uh oh. I'm gonna have to start butting heads with them. Um. 
I don't have anything. Uh, yeah, I'd love to open borders. Wish in Istanbul would open borders. Uh, I have bronze working, but I need iron working. Orange over here is Boudica? Ooh, better commerce. Um, archers, you also head to the east. Hang on. Worker, I want you to build... Does a cottage have to be... Has to be within the border. Ugh. Yeah, that's the Celts. The Celtic? The... I don't even know. In fact... Let me open... Where is Diplomacy? Might as well look at this. Um, hmm. I can see more stuff when I get better. When I have more of these EPs. Um, I want to put my focus on them because the fact that he hasn't offered open borders with me scares me. You build a cottage. He's starting to surround my city. That's not good. Hey, buddy. What do you think you're doing? What civics do I have? Mm -hmm. I want to get liberalism, then. Also, economics. Uh, hmm. Some of these actually look really useful. Seriously, where's my diplomacy screen? open our borders. Yeah, but, uh, kind of want a dream. Oh, you're not going to give it to me? <sighs> Jerk. Let's surround him with military as a precaution. Aha! I'm in first place! You fortify here. Um, I don't really want another settler yet. Ooh, I have horses. should have figured. Yeah. Adirna... Oh, I got a free technology. Um, I think that math the alphabet is the most expensive one here.
could have sworn the oracle was a person, though. You know, the oracle at Delphi. Which I'm probably ruining the pronunciation of. Um, gets better. Trade a priest. Not really all that useful to me. I want a terrorist. The classical era. I gain no bonuses, I guess. Have the power to both destroy and heal. When words are both true and kind, they can change our world. Oh, I can get the currency. Nice. Yay, yeah, jerk. Rabble, rabble. I'm just gonna stay there. Um, I want you to start exploring up this way. That'll take you a lot of turns. You're done with the cottage, so just automatically build improvements here. What are you doing? So I don't want you up here. You should hammer your iron when it is glowing hot. When I have iron near a city, I can make um swordsman currency. Yes. Oh, I have a great person, a great prophet. He can join my city to give me two production and five gold per second per second turn. Discover a technology or start a golden age. Um, honestly, I think I'm just gonna go with a technology. Meditation brings wisdom. Lack of meditation leads ignorance. Know well what leads you forward and what holds you back. Yeah, you just fortify. Because I really don't appreciate what you guys are doing. Let's see here. I get monotheism. You get writing? Um, yeah, that sounds great. Free technology. Because I don't lose writing. He just gains it. I got... I have the Great Wall before I have the walls upgrade in the town. Shouldn't the Great Wall count as having walls? Um... Let's go with a library. You guys need a terrace. I am the Lord thy God. Thou shalt have no other gods before me. Organized religion. Cities with that get buildings 25% faster. Can build missionaries without a monastery. Um. Nah. That's still not worth it. Great American people. Oh. The. I'd gladly take a pipe. But is that really historically accurate to give a pipe? Open borders? Oh, of course I will take open borders. Oh, great, I have another forest. <coughs> Let's see here. Um... Oh, these people are not happy right now. <laughs> yeah, you guys just help me with my research. You guys build a wall upgrade. Yeah, 
Hinduism doesn't seem so bad. Plus, I get plus one happiness. Unfortunately, that also means that I can't really. Wait, a Chinese religion. Honestly, Hinduism is not a bad thing to have right now. Because plus one happiness, very useful. Um, You learn polytheism and I learn sailing. Okay. Um, ooh. I got a crab. You get a sheep. Thank you. You can't direct the wind, but you can adjust your sails. Everything Currency, yeah. Enables gold trading. Now I can buy things off of people for gold. Um, metal casting allows to build forges, which increase production. I'll take monarchy, and I'll actually adopt it. Um, okay, so I still have upgrades I can build here. I will build... I have monastery here. Let's see here. Uh, I want you guys to switch over from research. I want you to build walls. And then I need, after this I need to start, um, building more Keicha so that I can start declaring war because I really don't appreciate that city being right next to me. Well, actually, hey, Mehmed, um, I, want, I really want that. A hundred gold. Oh, I can have him declare on other things. Yeah. I'll also teach you fishing if you attack. Oh, jeez. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't lose a thing. I also don't happen to know where Sitting Bull is at, so... Yeah, let's make another archer. Archers! Sorry. Too much Warlock Master of the Arcane. Which is quite similar to this game. Oh, they... You built some Keisha. Um, I guess they did declare war on me. Oops. Alright, I need you to go back to the city here. A multitude of rulers is not a good thing. Let there be one ruler, one king. Hereditary rule, military and units and cities increase happiness, please. Which also means I have no research right now. Um, theology. Don't worry, my. Um, you guys need city raider. I have, I have no idea where Sitting Bull actually is. Let me 
we see my foreign advisor. I'm also going to declare war on you. Alright, I want you guys to fortify the city. I want my Keisha to start heading this way. Alright, where is... oh. They're up here. Whoops. Um, archers, you get... Plus to city defense. Wait, where are these archers? Oh yeah, you fortify. There. Oh jeez. Does it, I guess it takes a movement point too. Wait. What do I have a scout up here? Oh yeah, he actually can't attack, because he's a defender. I don't really need him to keep exploring, though. Um, 40 <laughs> gold for mysticism. Okay. Um, alphabet to help me in the war? Um, of course. <laughs> Here I need Ooh, a chariot, yes. This Keisha needs Shock. Because I need to start moving. These guys up here. Um, I'm gonna just go with a market in here. You get combat two. Uh, yeah, build a settler next, because I could use someone up here. Alright. Let's build a library. Chariot's gonna have strip combat. Withdrawal isn't that useful, I don't think, so. Any more units up there? What are you doing? Get up there! <coughs> You're way up! Yeah, you just kind of wander your way over here. It'll take you 20 turns, though. Um, Egyptians, I'm not doing anything with the Egyptians anyway, so. And having the Celtics on my side may help me. Uh, what are you. Just. What are you doing? Just go. Go! Fine, just I'll hit explore on you. Uh. I don't wanna. Fine. Ooh, half a million people. I hate how I have to keep doing this.
Ooh. A chariot killed a guy. Anarchy is over. Government reestablished. Yeah. Oh, gosh. This has been 86 turns. So, wow. I, this is probably an hour. Hope you guys enjoyed.